I was on a treadmill doing this session because it was all I could do at the time and I was still not giving up hope that I could show up at the trials. This was about 10 days out and uh, there was nobody else around. I just remember kind of lying on the floor in tears because I knew that it was kind of over. Uh, so I've been thinking about that a bit, you know, the last couple of days because, uh, yeah. I mean, these are the low moments, everyone goes through them. So it's uh it makes these higher uh these higher moments all the more special put it that way uh and i've got a lot of people to thank for for getting me there because <laughs> i've been down but so is everyone else that's part of the game <laughs> and you were injured as well at the start of the year and yeah. um, so it's not only been a tough few years but it's been a tough year this year itself yeah yeah it has um there were moments there where i doubted that this was possible too so yeah that makes it special too uh but again, just had so many good people in my corner and uh, I'll give them to thank. Um, feels lucky in that respect, but yeah, I, I didn't give up this year and I made so many uh, yeah, decisions when the chips were down that kind of led me to this point. So proud of myself, but also just like, yeah, incredibly grateful that my own people kind of didn't give up the hope. They kind of knew that, yeah, I could turn this around. <laughs> So, yeah, I, uh, it makes it all the more special today, is what I'm trying to say. <laughs> and emotions are high today, but <laughs> are, what yeah. are they going to be like in Paris in a few weeks? <laughs> I'll try not to be so emotional then, I'll need to be calmer. But, uh, yeah, I'll allow my, myself a couple of days to enjoy this a bit. Um, but it's head down back to work because the job is so far from done from what I want to achieve this year. But, yeah, today feels special nonetheless. And what's the plan from now until Paris then? Uh, the plan is to go to San Moritz on Wednesday and kind of resume the work at altitude. It seems to work for me. So yeah, there's there's a good group that I have of uh, Under Armour athletes that Under Armour athletes I train with in Flagstaff. So we've had a number of athletes make the Olympics. So I'm fortunate to have a lot of people there. Our group has just gotten stronger and stronger and these guys are just making me better every year. So fortunate to have them around and We've got a lot of people that aren't just happy to make that team uh, in Paris. We want to go there and do some special things too. Super, well thank you and well done today. Thanks so much. Thanks.